Hello Lola's, welcome back to my channel. Guys, you are here and watching Baby Major. <laughs> I had to take my time, I was like, uh, which baby I have here? But anyway guys, I'm glad that you are subscribed to my channel. I do appreciate every time that you guys click the like button and I do appreciate all your comments. I'm just so over the moon with this baby. Like my collection right now is to a point where Every time I think like, oh, I need to buy this kit. There's a kit that I want to buy. There's two kits that I want to buy, silicone kits. And I'm like, I need to make money in order to buy these kits. I, there's like no babies that I am willing to part with at this time. I, I am so excited about what my collection is going to become in 2021 right now. I just, I've, I've never felt so good like about painting my own babies and stuff like that. So I'm just really, really excited. Um, I have um, some silicone babies in the work that I will be painting for my personal collection. So I'm expecting a boy, possibly a girl, because I'm not sure which way Alex will be, if it will be a girl or a boy. And um, I also found, I finally found me a sleeper girl silicone baby kit that I really really like and I'm really thinking about considering getting it so let's just go ahead and get this all one don't get his socks off let's start there um I think the most part that I love about him so much is with his painting is that he has this very soft look and I've been working so hard to get my texturing just right to where it's like not dry but it has that very you know it has that very skin look and I I think his came out the best and then you guys can't see this on camera but the way that his feet is done as painted it just looked like real skin it's just really I I'm just really in awe of him um, the sculpt itself does a lot too as well but anyway let me see if I can get him dressed I hate to cover him up <sighs> it's just like my other babies I but sometimes when they get in clothes they be like oh my gosh they're so cute like you just so I'm like all right I want to you know put put them on you know regular clothes sometime but it's hard. So he hasn't been rooted yet because he was supposed to go and I couldn't part with him. I wasn't ready. Um, I do have that sometime. Sometime babies don't go out for hair because I can't, I can't be without them. Like Lily Grace, I want to send her to get hair, but she'll probably not ever go out. And even though I don't like I don't like I work a full-time job I'm a full-time mom I don't have time and I'm like right now kind of like a full-time artist as well I don't have time to sit and change change my babies or hold them as much and stuff as one would think but I still every single day look at my collection look at my babies walk past them I may you know switch their position up a little bit or something it's just something that I do. And when one is not there, I'm like, I don't know, I'm just weird. I just be wanting the baby. This may be too big of a diaper, but we'll see. We'll see. Um, so just really loving him. Congrats to all the mommies that got new babies. He has a binky, but I, I don't really care to see him with his binky in. Um, but yeah, I said he, he'll be okay with hats for a while. He's a boy. It don't matter to me. It's not like he's going to be wearing headbands or anything. So hats are cute accessories. Um, I'm definitely, I definitely love hair on my babies I won't ever tell that lie that I don't because I actually like I'm in the process of rooting um I'm in the process of rooting another baby 
and I find myself just rubbing through her hair all the time. I love the feel of, you know, the hair on the baby, and I also love the look. It it does pretty much just really completes them, but um, I am not. There are some babies I I just totally love with or without hair, and he's one of them. Um, I'm very proud of him. Like if there was a doll show this year, I would so take him. He would him and Cody would be right there to show off. That's how proud I am of them. I'm really proud of them. Um when I was and I, I may do a video just showing y'all when I rinse Cody hair off. Like when I was doing his hair, it was just so cool because he looked so real in my arms. It was like, like my mind was playing tricks on me type thing. I just, I don't know. Oh my goodness. Now, isn't that adorable? Like he doesn't need clothes on beyond that, right? <sighs> He's so sweet. Let me see if I can, I can get closer to him. <laughs> I just love him so much. Wait, wait, let me see. You guys can see him. Look at that little face. Come on guys, you, you gotta tell me. He's just so adorable. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, I just love him. Y'all have no idea. Like, so we were talking about like, what do you love more, sleepers or weight babies? And I am naturally just instantly drawn to sleepers. But I do tend to do more with my awake babies. I really just love watching my sleep babies sleep. <laughs> and I know that sounds weird, but I will hold them. But I tend to want to pick up the awake ones a lot more because it seems like you just shouldn't deserve the sleeping baby, if that makes sense. So my um he's been in a whole nother bedroom and like laying in the um like the stroller like display i could not move him from that position he looked so real and i literally go down downstairs check in on him just to see him posed in that thing you know when i'm or when i'm passing by that room i'll peek in there and look at him and just smile i would not i would not bother him and he stayed there for days like that so yeah it's it's so i'm trying to see if it goes can I crisscross? Yes. So I don't know. So is it is it so I think I have a kinda almost equal with both asleep and awake now. But I do tend to collect more asleep because that's who I'm naturally drawn to. It takes a lot for me to like an awake baby because most awake babies don't tend to look as realistic and a lot of times they actually tend to have more of a dolly look if that makes sense and i don't necessarily like that <laughs> don't, don't, don't. <gasps> i'm so sweet <laughs> look at that look at that little booger oh my gosh <sighs> i love him oh my goodness i know you guys probably like girl shut up it's not that deep but he just, oh my God, he just makes me, I just love, 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 love him. Oh my God. Like, it's so weird. Like, I actually feel like I have like a designer baby in my collection right now. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I feel like I bought him from somebody other than myself. Like, I don't feel like I painted him. I don't. I mean, and even... I don't know. It's just everything came out so nicely on him. His eyebrows, his eyelashes rooted in good. 
I don't know. It's just I I I don't usually do this with my own babies. Like I don't usually you know, the ones that I make. I usually feel this way and talk this way about other people work, not my own. So anyway, that's my little pook. I just realized he got on yellow now. He can blend in with the crew. Although I just took Cody out of his yellow. I'm gonna put Cody back in yellow. So everybody, when I do my nursery tour, everybody have on the same colors. But I wasn't thinking about that. But we'll see, we'll get him back. We'll find some more yellow for Cody by that time. But I guess he has on blue. They're wearing yellow and blue, so it still works. But anyway, oh, little major. <laughs> I will see you guys later. Thanks, guys, again for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Don't forget to click the like button. Don't forget to share this video in your groups, in your thing. Um, if I haven't said it on any other videos, I want to say it again. Shout out to... Um, Beautiful Ethnic Reborns group on Facebook. Um, T always gives me shout outs. She shares my videos and I appreciate that a lot. Um, I do have my own Facebook group as well, but I do um, thoroughly enjoy her group as well because it's just a lot of babies in there and stuff. And it seems like it's one of the more popular groups beyond, you know, Reborn Baby Addicts. Um, yeah, it's really, it's really cool. And they have live streams and stuff like that. So, you know, Facebook lives and stuff. So it's, it's really nice. Um, I, you know, I actually, I'm like, wow, it's really nice that they actually, you know, come together like that. So I, I, I like the, the temperament of the group. So if you guys are not members, you know, make sure you go and try to join that group. But anyway, guys. I appreciate you guys so much and I will see you guys soon. Um, one other last tidbit is I am still waiting for my wine glasses and stuff to arrive. I've already placed the order. As soon as they come in, I'll start you know, packaging them up or sh at least I'll show them first one of each and then some of you guys are going to end up with one. So thanks guys. Later.